Okay, I'm back and I'm going to be showing how to record your screen on a Mac using QuickTime Player. Again, this only works on Mac and you have to use a different piece of software on a Windows computer. So the first step you must do is you must go to your launch pad, which should be in your dock. If it's not, go up to the magnifying glass and click launch pad. And I can't spell it. And go to launch pad. And so it'll open. And so once you're in your launch pad, you're going to need to go up to search and type in quick and press enter and you'll get on QuickTime Player. It might not look like you're on QuickTime Player, but nothing pops up. But you are on QuickTime Player because you can see it up here. Let me get back off that. If you do not have Launchpad, if you're on an older version of Mac and you're not updated, then at the top just type in QuickTime. And open it up and you are on. And once you open QuickTime Player, then you'll go to File, New Screen Recording. It's only not letting me because I'm doing a screen recording to show this. But once you click New Screen Recording, a window that looks like this will pop up. And it'll look like this. And then you click this button right here. If you want to record without audio, you just click that button right there. And then you just follow the prompts that are on the screen. So it'll say something like drag to select what you want to record or click the screen to record the whole screen or something like that. But just follow the prompts. If you want to record with audio, and go back in your quick time. Same thing, file, new screen recording. And then you go to this, like I showed you a minute ago. And then you go to the drop down, and then it'll say microphone. And you'll go down to built in microphone, internal microphone if it's built in. And if not, you'll do, there'll be, if you have it plugged in your computer, it'll say line in microphone. And then it'll just say external microphone, and you click on that. And once you do that, when you click audio and then select your thing, click the record button, then you will be able to record with audio and you'll be able to hear your voice. And that's about all that you have to do to record audio with QuickTime Player.